What is up guys, Beach HD here and today you can see I'm bringing you my favourite possible FIFA 13 squad that I've played with online, just overall so far on the game. Um, you'd probably be surprised by it, um, it's worth no more than about, what should you say, about 7k, no, uh, um, no shiny players in it at all. It's just a really, really good squad that I use. You, I've used it in the World Domination series when I used to do that. And it's just a brilliant, brilliant team to have. I've had it, had it since the opening week. It's a full Spanish team. And the first player is Guayati. Guata. Apologise for any names that I miss say in this. But he's a three-star week four. He's a goalkeeper. Don't matter too much. But dive in of 81. Reflex of 86. And positioning of 79. Those are three his main stats for him. Really, really good keeper. You'll see a good save that he makes in one of the clips near the end. Then the Chelsea right back, we've got Cesar Tanko as Plusueti. Bought 600 coins, 3 star weak foot, 3 star skills, 80 pace, 76 passing, and 77 defending. So they're pretty good stats for a non shiny Spanish right back. Um, pretty good there, to be honest with you. Next, we have the first of centre backs. Um, I think we've hit Bot here. Yeah. Um, bought for 550 coins, it's really cheap, 3 star weak foot. Um, probably these prices will have gone down by since when I got them on the opening week or so. Pace is 62, 77 defending, 78 heading, so some good stats there for a centre back. Then we also have the second centre back who is Flano. Um, he has some quite nice stats, he links up well. Um, Seeing as he is in the same league as the goalkeeper and centre back, 69 pace, why? Uh, defending 76 and heading 80. So there's the two centre backs, the right back and the goalkeeper. We're just waiting now for Didac, the AC Milan left back. So uh, three star weak foot, but for 600 coins as well. Um, 78 pace, 76 defending. The rest of his stats aren't amazing, only 70 heading. 71 dribbling, 71 passing, I think that was. So it's not amazing. Now we have Notlito, 84 pace, you can see. He's got 4 star skill moves, 3 star weak foot, but for 500 coins, it's pretty much an absolute steal. Plays for Benfica as well. Pace is 84, dribbling is 84, shooting not too good at 74, and passing at 74 as well. So he's got the pace and he's got the power that you need, really. Uh, Julio Garcia um, is the first centre mid for Atletico Madrid, I think that is. Um, bought for 400 coins, 3 star weight foot, 2 star skill moves. Uh, 65 pace, 71 shooting, 77 passing, dribbling 72, and then average defending and heading stats there. We also have, um, I think that's Hernandez, I think that might be right, yeah. No, Herrera. Uh, three four star weak foot, four star skill moves, but quite cheap as well. 76 pace, 78 passing, and 79 dribbling, which is pretty good stats for a centre midfielder um, overall, so it's pretty good. Next of all is the right midfielder, Pablo Hernandez. He's uh, really good, but 550 coins, four star skill moves, three star weak foot. He's got quite, pretty good skill moves this whole squad on the whole. 83 pace, 83 dribbling. Essential shooting, average other stats, but there's about four or five different players with four star skill moves, which is really good and helpful because I do like to do skills when I'm playing with them. Then the first one we do have the Adrian, but for 800 coins, three star skill moves and three star weak foot, really really good player. 85 pace, 85 dribbling, 74 shooting. His shooting does feel better than that. When you do play with him in game, it's um just just feel a little bit better than what it says on the card. So the final striker now that we have is Rodrigo, another really, really good striker for Benfica. So that completes the full Spanish team, four star skill moves, three star weak foot, but for 850 coins as well. So I don't think this is over 7k. So it's really cheap, really, really good. You can see my record in the top right now. Um, just as quickly as pace 85, shooting 76 and dribbling 78, I think that was. So um, the main best players in here are probably the strikers. Uh, the Athletic Madrid centre midfielder is really, really good as well. Um, also, the left mid is pretty beasty when he's sprinting down the wing. And the record with this team that I've played on this account, I've used them on a different account as well, is um, I think they're currently on 17 wins to 2 losses. So it's a really, really good strong side on this account. 
and you can see a couple of goals and things now as Rodrigo, Hernandez and Adrian and all them goals start to pop in so at this stage it would be great if you've not dropped a like already please do um, if this could get to 38 likes is going to be this video's target the last one did hit um, this is going to be a really really good goalkeeper save you can see here you can see this point my goalkeeper woo, really really good save I, I stood still because I thought it scored but no really good save but yeah 35 like 38 likes would be great seeing as last video did hit 50 that we targeted um, so yeah that would be really really good now this team is fully recommendable um, for only 7k pretty much anyone can afford it and the strike as you can see you can see Rodrigo there using his strength his three star skill moves there to do the um, nice chop nice little uh, roulette spins and it is re just a really good player they can also pass really nicely as well because it is a, of course it's a Spanish team so obviously they're passing and they're basic stats like that are really really good and if you can remember from the world domination series you will remember this squad um, when it did win the gold uh, cup with them and you should remember that they were really really overpowered with heading got lucky on that goal there by right, Adrian but really really powerful with headers and that is this team it's pretty much an all round brilliant team I think I score a nice finesse here yeah we do outside of the box pretty hard to score so they can score pretty much every single type of goal you want. They score loads of headers, loads of just powerful low shots. Some nice skill goals as well. Get unlucky hitting the post there. So it's pretty much the perfect team. So um, I think I'm going to try and get another video up either tomorrow or the day after tomorrow. I've built a squad which has three players in it from this week's team of the week for a player review. And I might even do a squad builder with it as well. So... um. The three players that we'll have reviews on throughout the week will be the 88 informed Benzema, the Jose Enrique, I think that's his name, yeah, the in, currently in left mid, and also Santi Carzola informed this week as well. So I've got all those in a team, just need to record some clips and get commentaries done. But that will be it for that. Um, this video is now coming to an end. Please do let me know what you think of this in the comments. I wasn't spending as much as you want and you can't really complain about it because it is just my favourite team to use, my own opinions really. So uh, please do remember to drop a like, drop a comment as well, just what you thought of it, any anything you want to do for our next squad builder please and um, see you guys later.